that's not a bad thing. Thank you for being here today. And Camden, thank you for challenging us again to give us some tools. That we can use daily in our lives. And I just want to thank the church in general for uh, stepping up like we have over these past few months. We don't have a pastor if you're visiting right now. And so a lot of lay people have been helping out by providing uh, worship uh, thoughts and music and all kinds of things. And Camden, on very short notice, um, he said that he heard last night that he was going to be helping out with first service, and that's true. Um, I told him this morning that the person that was supposed to be here for second service sent me a message at 6 this morning and Kevin said, I'll do it. So I, I really appreciate that spirit, Kevin. <laughs> Thank you all for being here. If this is your first time at the experience, uh, we really appreciate you being here and, and want to invite you to come back and worship with us again. I want to invite all of you to stay for lunch. Lunch is being provided, and when you just go out through the doors past the little coffee table, there'll be lunch in that room, and so we would invite you to stay and just get to know us a little better by doing that. Last uh, weekend, I mentioned that we had a pastor that was going to be interviewed uh, to perhaps become the pastor of the experience, and no decisions have been made, but that person and his family will be here this coming weekend and we'll speak here next Saturday. So if you don't have plans, please be here because we would like uh, everybody possibly to listen and just kind of give a, a perspective of what they're thinking. And um, I'm not going to share uh, that person's name right now, and I just want to briefly explain why. They are currently a pastor at another church. They have a church family that doesn't know that they might be accepting a call somewhere else. And so to protect that other church family from being uncomfortable about something that may or may not happen because we haven't made a decision yet, we're not going to say that person's name until next weekend when they're here. So hopefully you can understand that I think we feel the same way if that was us in that position. So that's, that's um, what's going on there. So I would invite you to uh, be here next Sabbath and, and listen. Let's bow our heads and have a blessing on our meal right now, and then we'll go in there and have lunch. Dear Father, thanks again for being with us today, and thank you for being challenged again this morning. I pray that each one of us can maybe learn one little text that can help prepare us um, in a time of temptation during this next week. Thank you for this good food that we're about to eat now, and as we um, eat it, I pray that you'll bless it, nourish our bodies, and help us as we... Um, have an opportunity to visit with new friends. In Jesus' name, amen.